Hey everybody, it's Scott Steen with Winners and Winers, host of Bank the Bed podcast, coming to you once again, courtesy of the YouTube, to talk a little bit about the Buffalo Bulls and the Ohio Bobcats tonight in Maction. Well guys, if you tune in regularly, you'll know that Maction is currently kicking my butt. Uh, we are 0-3 on our Maction picks. Didn't love the pick last night. Didn't love the picks last week. You know what? So far, I've sounded like uh, a little bit of a whiny little bitch. So we're going to change that because you know what we got tonight? We got a game that I actually like. Uh, the Buffalo Bulls catching two on the road against the Ohio Bobcats. Uh, by the way, in honor of uh, college football tonight, I am rocking the T-shirt of the Graceland right here. <laughs> right over here. It's the Graceland uh, Yellow Jackets. They are the current NAIA NAIA Division I National Basketball Champions. Shout out to the Jackets. By the way, if anybody has extra uh, extra college gear they want me to wear of your home school, send it along. This is uh, this is one of our viewers. I love it. Uh, as you can guess, I'm about a medium, uh, a, a ladies' large, men' medium. I'm kidding. Two uh, X, three X would be fantastic. So anyway, all right. So here we go. Uh, the Buffalo Bulls. Tale of the tape goes a little something like this. The Bulls are nine and one straight up. Eight and two against the number, seven and two as far as the overs versus under. The unders uh, come in only twice, while the over has cashed seven times. The Ohio Bobcats six and four straight up, six and four against the number, and the over has cashed five of their nine games. Buffalo is having a magical season, and shout out to one of our viewers who uh, gave me a hard time last week when I bet against the Bulls actually bet on that game up there in the wind to stay under. And he, he told me how great the Bulls' rushing offense was while I countered with, I thought the Bulls were actually a little better passing since they'd thrown for 684 yards the previous two weeks. However, what did they do last week? They made me look like an absolute maroon. They rushed the ball 57 times for 358 yards up there in the 40-mile-an-hour winds in Buffalo. The rushing attack was absolutely dominant. So, I'm a believer. I'm a believer in the Bulls. They are having a truly magical season. They lead the East. They are perfect against the number in conference play. 6-0. and oh, They have won everything in sight except for a game against Army when Army beat them outright and with the spread. Luckily for the Bulls, they're not seeing any more triple options for the rest of the season. And this game is gonna come down to the Bulls and the ability of the Ohio Bobcats to stop the Bulls. I don't think that's gonna happen. Ohio is decent, they're, uh, they're, they're, they're okay, but the uh, defense is just not gonna be stout enough to handle the Bulls. Uh, and on the offensive side of the ball, when Ohio has the ball, they're just 79th in passing. They're 18th in rushing, that's their strength. However, that plays into the Bulls' strengths. They are 17, 37th in the nation in defense as far as yards per carry goes, averaging just over 4.1 yards per carry. Against them, their pass defense is fantastic, ranking 12th in the nation. I think the Bulls get it done here against Ohio. Finally, a game I like. I think we got the wrong team favored, the Bulls. One of the, one of the best, uh, if not certainly in their conference, uh, maybe even in the country. And uh, I know the Bulls would like to do great things. This is, this is one of these conferences where style points counts. Every little bit is going to be fought for. Nobody's going to be pulling any punches in the third or fourth quarter. The Bulls, if they have the opportunity, will score as many points as possible. Take the Bulls, take the two points, and I believe you and I will be heading back to the window. This is Scott Steen for Winners and Winers. Make sure you stop by and check out Winners and Winers. All of our great daily sports content, if you don't know about what we do, stop by and check it out because all we do is handicap every single game going on in America every single day. Nobody on the internet does a deeper dive of a contest on a daily basis. Check out Winners and Winers, everything. You're going to dig it. I promise, as always, every pick is 100% free. So you could pay for them, but why would you want to? We can get high quality stuff like that right at Winners and Winers. So check out the site and be sure and follow us on facial, facial media. Be sure you follow us on social media. Do all that usual stuff. Like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. And of course, most importantly, if you're digging the video, if you're digging our videos, give us a thumbs up. 
subscribe to our channel. That way uh, you hit that little bell and you'll get an alert every time one of these is posted. So this is Scott Steen inviting you to uh, yeah, hang with us, check us out tomorrow. Until then, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.